Hello everyone, Grown 11 here, back with another video today. If you like what you see, make sure to leave a like and let me know what you thought about the video down below. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon to stay up to date with all the videos. Mahalo. <clears throat> We're gonna go, go ahead and make a video here. So, uh, aloha everybody from the YouTube channel, Twitch. If you'd like to say hello to YouTube, I know you guys always do. Feel free to do so. We're actually going to go through and take a look at these new transmogs. Some of you guys have already been seen these. I have not seen these yet and I've only heard about it and I've only seen the image that they post in the notice uh, about the update of these transmogs. So I'm super excited to take a look at these, take a look at the animations and see how good they are. Yeah, one thing that I'm looking forward to, not looking forward to is this pioneer, but the one thing I hate is that there's no parrot, but we'll talk about that in a little bit. We're going to start off like we always do from the bottom up. And we're going to start off here with the Penguin, the three-star, Passionate Knight, Penguin Knight. I don't know why they have to put the word knight twice. Why can't it just be Passionate Penguin Knight, yeah? Passionate Knight, Penguin Knight, okay. Oh, it's probably because, actually, never mind. I'm an idiot. Yeah, once it awakens, it's going to be called Passionate Knight, Math, or Passionate Knight, bleh, right? Okay, that makes sense then. All right, all right, come to us one step ahead. All right, all right. So, I think this uh, transmog looks cool. The only issue is that I feel like... The theme for the penguin have been just like the last one was a tuxedo one and then this one's kind of like uh, a fancy i don't know knight looking kind of uh penguin so it's too kind of similar right i wanted to see more of a drastic uh theme change but it's very similar let's go ahead and take a look here at the water uh penguin let's see what the uh, the skill looks like here skill one. Oh, that's actually pretty nice it goes a little a little uh little stream of light behind him dashing in i do like that he falls is that normal? I don't remember what the, the penguins do normally. But that's actually kind of cute. Yeah, three musketeer look. That's right. Uh, Lucid with the gifted sub to Rancid. Thank you for the gifted sub. Lucid, I appreciate that. Yeah, all the people trying to gift subs here and sub uh, during the uh, the video. <clears throat> Thank you, Lucid. Appreciate the gifted sub to Rancid as well as uh, Blackie2017 with the six month resub. Hi, YouTube. Congrats on the silver badge, Blackie. I appreciate that, man. As well as Rehab with the 10-month resub. Hi, YouTube. See, I figured. Thank you guys for the resub. I appreciate it very much, and uh, Happy New Year's. And uh, hello to your future self. All right, so like I was saying, I think it's it's kind of cute that uh, the, the penguins fall down after the first skill. Let's take a look at start of battle here. Or start battle. Okay. Cool. It's a pretty nice stream dash, I guess. Yeah, usually, the way these transogs work is that... The three star is not as nice as the four star. It's not as nice as the five star in terms of animation. But this three star, this three star animation is not bad for the uh, the penguin so far. I, I kind of like it. Now the only issue is that you know which one do people use the most, and it's just Mav, right? The, the other ones are not used as often. Maybe some of you guys have found some uses for them, but um, I haven't really used any of the other elements. I've tried the light one before in the past uh, in uh, as a sort of cleanser in raids, but it just didn't do the job. Yeah, and uh, it just the AI was just not good enough in my opinion, so I couldn't I couldn't uh, use it effectively, so I stopped using it. But I do have it built. Request battle. Huh, okay. All right, here's Mav. This is the one of interest here. Skill one, of course. I love how he falls down. Yeah. All right, declare war. I wish there was no crit animation so I can see what's what's happening to him. Can you like, please? Can you like stop critting, please? Stop. Stop critting. How can you crit every... How can you... There we go. Oh my god. There's no animation on him anyways. Rip. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Wings of Wind. <laughs> I like I like the way the the, 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 the the image of the wing flapping in the air. I don't know. There's something about the way that it flaps. It's like... Doing. Doing. Okay. I kind of like that. Okay. Sorry. Don't mind me. Uh, anyways. Uh, let's take a look at the... The light one here. Yeah, start battle. These are all the same. Yeah, ready ready to attack. Okay, here we go. Oh, there's no wing on this one. This is just a, that other symbol, that, uh, that, that attacking looking symbol. Two trumpets or whatever it is. Okay, and the dark one. Uh, declare war. Nothing special either, right? No, same. And undefeated warrior. That's probably the biggest animation out of all of them. All right, um, overall, I think uh, the penguin's okay. Yeah, it looks okay, and the animations are solid. You know, it's not, you can't really say it's really underwhelming because of the fact that it's a three-star. That's how three-star animations are usually, right? So, I like it. Not bad. Yeah, not bad. 
Uh, succubus, yeah, alluring uh, succubus, or you guys like to say succubus, same thing, yeah, potato, to po tomato, potato, well, potato, potato, tomato, tomato. Yeah, and I will say it because it's controversial. Jif, gif. Uh, yep, mm -hmm, I said it. Yeah, succubus, uh, succubus, same same thing. All right, let's take a look at skill one here. So the, the Trasmog overall looks nice. Yeah, I like the way, uh, wait, let me look here. I like the way it looks. I like the horns that it has. It's uh, kind of nice. I like the bats that are coming out of the ground with the aura. It's not bad. Yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely not bad. Let's go ahead and see. So skill one. Okay, and then you get some bats. Okay. All right, I see it. And you get some bats at the uh, at the area where you hit. Skill two, Twisted Joy. Huh. It comes from the air. This skill used to come from the ground. So that's that's kind of interesting. Is there something that comes out of the ground? No, that'd be cool if something comes out of the ground when it hits um, uh, from the top. I think that would've been uh, a lot nicer, in my opinion. All right, Brutal End. Mm. I think it looks a lot sleeker now, but you know, am I am I wrong to say I liked how the original uh, Fire Succubus third skill looks with the with the stuff going up into the air from the ground? I don't know. I, I really don't know. Yeah. Okay. Let's take a look at the water one here. Zarya. Skill one. Hundred percent sleep apparently. Yeah. Strike of rejection. Okay. Uh, parting gift. All right. Yeah, it's, it's, it's sleek. I feel like a lot of times with these animations that they've been doing for their transmogs, the, the animation is always just like a big ray of light. Yeah, that explosion of light is kind of like what they always do. Yeah, a little bit underwhelming. That they're just like, oh, what should we do? Ah, uh, just just put a ray of light there and we're good to go. Call it a transmog. Yeah, I don't know. Even this one, this one, this fire one was underwhelming. I thought this was gonna be a little bit nicer. Yeah, this actually doesn't look as nice as the regular one in my opinion. Okay, let's try this one. What is this one's called? Celine? Oh my god, how did I know that? Let's go one. Strike a rejection. Okay. Skill three, blooming nightmare. Eh, okay. Yeah, it, it does look better than the original one, but the original one just like had something coming out of the ground. I don't know. Yes, yeah, Selena. Oh, okay. Sorry. Gomez or no? Sorry. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Uh, the light one. Aria skill one. Striker rejection skill two. And this one should be big, right? Curse of White Knight. Eh. Eh, okay, I like I like the little touch there they did with the sparkles though. Yeah, making it kind of sparkle a little bit with that glitter. Yeah, kind kind of kind of um, kind of makes it uh, appealing to me. I guess you could say. Yeah, the little sparkle of glitter. All right. Uh, let's see here, the dark one. Yeah, somebody did ask about the dark one today. Let's get a twisted joy, coming from the sky though instead of the ground. I, I don't know if I like that. Yeah, I don't know if I like that. Okay, uh, Night Hag Scuttle. It's like the, it be, the original animation was this huge thing swooping down from behind. Let's take a look. Okay, it, it's now, instead of just anything, it's now an actual bat flapping its wings. Okay. It's, it's kind of nice. It's because it's, it's, it's kind of big. Yeah, it's kind of nice. All right. Overall, I think, again, Sakubis are okay. Nothing different. Nothing special. A lot of us, we want something different. You know, of course, we want, like, units that look good. Right, that's the first thing, in my opinion, that's the first thing. You have the 3D model, and then after that, animations that are kind of new or different, right, is what we're looking for. And uh, we have yet to uh, see anything from the Scubus. Uh Into the Ninjas. Cyborg Ninja. Hey, yo, this thing's kind of dope. Wait, is it just me or... Yo, I kind of like this. This is, this is kind of nice. This 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 could go really well with a lot of the cyborg sets. Like you know how the 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 uh, the, the Griffins have that kind of mechanical look, and Bella or the uh, Inugamis have the mechanical look, and what is it? Tarks, all those Hellhounds have the mechanical look. You can make it like a mechanical looking team. I like it. Yeah. You know what? This reminds me of.
Sorry. Yeah, just had a moment. All right. Anyways, uh, back to uh, looking look at the transmogs. <laughs> I never said it, okay? <laughs> I never said nothing. All right? You, you, you said it. All right? You heard it. You said it. I didn't say nothing. All right. Anyways, uh, yeah, let's take a look at... Uh, Let's take a look at Genji. I mean, uh, Gato. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Okay, uh, let's take a look. Let's start off with the water one. Yeah, uh, Susano. Uh, skill one. Oh! Oh! Hey, I like this! I like this! He does, like, a little spin, and then he throws the, like, the shuriken, or the, uh, the, the, the... It's supposed to be, a, a, a kunai, right? But it becomes, like, a shuriken. I don't know. That's kind of weird. Yeah, it's kind of nice! And the animation is kind of fast. This is one times, and it's going out that fast. Wow. I like it. Okay, okay. Skill two, slicing win. No. Did I see that right? Did I see some? Did I just see a blade? Like, did you just see a blade? It's a kunai. I did say kunai. A uh, rehab, but it's. But I'm saying when when it gets thrown out, like a, I said shuriken, but when it gets thrown out, it doesn't look like a kunai. Yeah, it's weird. It's it it, it, it see that the image is a kunai, but it comes out as it's actually a shuriken or a star. Weird. Yeah, but did I see a blade? Oh my god! That little touch right there. That's what I'm talking about. Different. That little touch right there is what I what I like. That blade. You see that? You see that? Just that that blade. Yeah. That lightsaber just like. Yeah, that that's the touch. I mean, the, the slice is very nice as well. But yo, that that the 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 the, 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 the blade coming out. That's the best, man. Oh, my God. All right. Uh, there's no third skill. Let's go over to Gato. Okay, it's going to be the same thing, right? Also has a passive. And, uh, 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 oh, you see the blade? You see that? Oh, my God. It's so fast. Dude, this is one times. This is one times. And it's this fast. God damn, man. New speed, DB10, GB10, NB10. All going to be ninjas. Because it's going to be so damn fast. That is insanely fast. All right, how about a, oh, Orochi here? Okay. Slicing win. Look at that. Look at the blade, man. All right, all right, all right. Okay, Storm and Gale. Wait, can I see it with no crit? No! No, dude. For real. Did you see that? He... Not even, bro. I'm going to use my Orochi for DB, uh, GB10 in this case. Look. And then he throws the... That is insane. This is a Nat 4. Yeah, because usually Nat 5s are the best animations, but this is a pretty damn sick animation. What? And all this... You see all the stars shooting out. Oh, the stars shooting out. Oh my gosh. It was supposed to be Kunai's. Look at... Oh, they hover in the air right next to him. Okay, that, it's, this is by far best one yet. This is by far best one yet. Hands down. Hands down. Hands up. No matter. The best one yet. Okay, maybe the Light Ninja too. Okay, I mean, if you got, if you, if you nice, I will, I will, I will use you more. Uh, again. All right, Sensation. Yeah. You know what it looks like? It looks like a Light uh, Gianna uh, third skill. Not really? Yes or no? It looks like it's like the, it's like it's like that Gianna thing. Yeah, it's okay. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's, it's it's not bad. I like it. It's not bad. It's decent. Very very decent in my opinion. Is it the most OP? Mm, no, but uh, is it decent? I like it. <clears throat> All right, let's check out the, the last one here, Han. Right? I mean, you obviously have to have a Han to, you know, have do this. But okay. Oh boy, this is gonna be a big one. Simple solution. Again, no crit. Eh, that's pretty nice, but... Yo, no, it's, just, uh, it's all about Orochi, man. Yeah, I'm sorry. If you got a Han out there, that's an LD Nat 5, bro. But sorry. Yeah, the Trasmog ain't that nice, bro. Yeah, the, the, <laughs> the Trasmog ain't that nice. Yeah. It's all about the Han. I mean, the, the uh, Orochi. Yeah. I like these Trasmog. So overall... I'm gonna give a pretty good rating to the, the ninjas here. This is one of the nicer four-star transmogs I've seen in a while. And I like the way it looks and the animations are actually really good. Yeah, animations actually very good. I like it. Alright, let's take a look at the dark, uh, I mean the desert queens here. 
Uh, Night Witch Desert Queen. Holy crap. Could you wear any... Could you wear a, 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 a cloak that was any bigger? Holy smokes. Look at this thing. Damn, man. That's some like that's some, like some some epic raid gear right there, man. Yeah, I'm talking I'm talking like the the 0.1% drop rate from Sunken Temple. Oh shoot, shoot wrong game. My bad. <clears throat> oh my gosh, dude. Jesus. Look at that scepter. Wait, is it candles? Girl, you got you got that magnificent cloak and then you got four candles as your staff. <laughs> Bro, I, I, I'm gonna need you to. Uh, how did you? Th those are candles, right? <laughs> I mean, the cloak is epic, but I don't know about the candles, bro. Okay, this is not supposed to be transmog gross, my bad. But all right, all right, let's take a look at the skills. Right? Overall, it, it doesn't look too bad. I actually like the looks, right? It's got a, it's got, it's got a little bit of personality in there. You know, you know what I'm talking about, right? <laughs> you want personality? Yeah, there, there, definitely some personality in here. Just, just say. All right, let's take a look at the step first. Skill one. Are those bats? Nah, don't tell me those are bats. Why? Why? What is the name of this theme again? Oh, Night Witch. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Night Witch. Night Witch. Okay, okay. I was like, why is it just copying this Kubit? Okay. Yeah, all right, cool. Yeah, there's bats that hover and then skill one. Bam. Okay, sure. Uh, Curse of the Beautiful. Yeah. Okay. That's not bad. <coughs> oh, sorry, my bad. Okay. <clears throat> Curse of the Beautiful. Okay, uh, let's take a look at skill three. This is probably the one that's gonna be nicer. <laughs> summon! No, okay, so we're not gonna summon right now. I have no space. All right, Oasis Blessing. Bro, could you have, could you have like, could you have gotten a bigger flower? Holy crap, dude, that flower huge. Look at that, you can't even see her. God damn, that's a big flower. You gotta put the whole vile plume on your face. God damn, it's a whole, there's a whole, there's like, what the? Nice. Pretty cool. Pretty cool, but it's huge. That thing is huge, bro. Damn. All right, I like it. I mean, I like it, cool. Yeah, we'll see, it increases animation time too, that's nice. All right, skill one here. All right, this is gonna be the the uh, the segment. Skill two, curse of the beautiful. Skill three, charming voice. I don't like the bat theme. Yeah, I really don't like the bat theme, and I'll tell you why. I don't like the bat theme because there's so many units already that have that bat theme, right? Already vampires, and now we have the Sakubas, and now they're doing another theme with the bats. I don't know if I like it. I don't know if I like it enough. Yeah, okay, let's check out Hathor here. I like I like the way they look though. Like the 3D model, they look very nice. Wow. Why is there a cross? Oh my gosh. There's a cross that radiates and then after that it sleeps. Okay, that's kinda cool. That's kinda cool. That's not bad. That's kinda cool. Yeah, that's that that's that's actually kinda cool. Alright, third skill here, delayed promise. Let's take a look. Oh my god, that's very sleek. Nice. The only thing is, I don't know, maybe I'm just used to seeing the pillars drop, like, doom, 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 doom. You know what I mean? The, the, the four pillars dropping. But I wish they did that with this, right? Even though it's, 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 it's like balls, I mean, they're pillars of light. I wish they, they like, they like made the pillars of light, like, emit, you know, just to keep with the same animation, like, boom, 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 boom. You know what I mean? That, that would have been way better. Yeah, with those anime, with those uh, animation sounds as well. Yeah, I think I think that would been cooler, but it's nice. I, I do like this animation. <clears throat> yeah, I, I do like this animation. Yeah, I like it. <clears throat> okay, let's look at uh, this unit here. Yeah, uh, glaze of oblivion, like I like to call it. I mean, we can take, take, take a look at skill one too. So skill one, skill two. <clears throat> And skill three, Glaze of Oblivion. That's pretty cool. That that's pretty cool. I like how it warps in. Yeah, the animation warps in. 
Yeah, so congratulations to the one, two, three, carry over the nine, 2019. Yeah, it's currently 11.27 a.m. on a Monday, the 15th here in Hawaii, times by two, multiply eight, Pythagorean theorem. There's uh, exactly 172 people with um, ISIS out there. Congratulations on uh, having this uh, unit. And uh, I think you guys will really enjoy this, um, this animation. Yeah, it's nice. It's not bad. <clears throat> Alright, uh, Nephthys, or Nephthys, I say Nephthys, some people say Nephthys, okay? Gif, gif. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna take a look here. Yeah, I don't think it has anything special about it, it's just the, um, the, the color of the explosions because of the fact that it's just a passive, right? So nothing special here. But alright, overall, <laughs> I don't know, man, after seeing the ninjas, uh, it hard, it's hard to give you guys a better rating, but, uh, I think the Desert Queens do look nicer. Yeah, they do look nicer, and I do like Hathor. That's the one that I pr would probably use the most as well, Hathor and Bastet. And I would say I would rate the Hathor and Bastet having the two best. I mean, of course, the, the light one is not bad, right? As well as we know, the light one is, you know, the animation's cool. But let's be real. Realistically, I'm going to be using Bastet and Hathor the most. So it's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad at all. I, I do like it. All right, last but not least... The most controversial one is the Pioneer, okay? And as you can see, we've already talked about it, right? Youngster Pioneer. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the thought process and the theme behind this was because of the fact that so many people have said the Awakened Pioneer is so much cuter, okay? It's just way cuter than the Awakened Pioneer. Or the other uh, Pioneer transmogs are okay as well, but the Awakened one, the Unawakened one is the best, right? Because he's cute. Right, he's tiny, he's got his little parrot that's like flying around. But they did this, right? So obviously, I mean, he looks cool. He's small, he's cute, right? Youngster pioneer. But where is the parrot? Like, like, like out of all the suggestions you heard come to us, yeah, everybody, everybody, everybody that suggested things, where did you hear us say, take the parrot out and put a butterfly? Where, how did you, how did you come up with that idea? Yeah? How, how did you, how, I don't, I don't understand. I really don't understand. Yeah, the parrot, the bird is, where is that? Okay, maybe if you want to change the parrot, right? Or the parakeet or whatever it is to a different bird, do it, right? Change it into like a, like a, like a hummingbird. I don't know, something else, right? If you wanted to be small like a butterfly, but don't take the bird, man. Yeah, that's, that was the best part. Yeah, I mean, one of the best parts. It's, it's the defining attribute of the pioneer, man. Yeah, you take it away. I don't know, bro. Okay, let's take a look, though. Yeah, let's take a look at skill animation. I do like how they look. I just, I'm just upset about no longer having a bird there. That's it. All right. Oh my God, he's short AF. All right. No way. No. No, I know what. No. There's no way you did that, cop to us. I, I, I am super jealous, like right now. How could you do this? Yeah? How could you make a transmog after Fwa before you make a transmog after before me? Huh? This is a guaranteed Fwa transmog. Yeah? Who has all the pioneers? Fwa. Huh? Who is not the tallest person out there? Fwa. This is Fwa. This is Fwa. Fwa inspired transmog. Fwa. Did you tell them to put a butterfly Fwa? Yeah? I swear to God, Fwa. If you, if you, if you told them to take away the parrot, God damn it. Four, god damn, dude. I I'm a message four after this, by the way. Yeah, god dang, dude. It's a four. It's a four transmog. Look at it. This four. Oh my god, dude. All right, all right, all right. Let's take a look at the animations. Let's get one. Is that a butterfly? All right, this is literally uh, this is a, literally like Chasun's like brother. Or just sudden's like boyfriend. Yeah, now that it makes sense. Yeah, there's butterflies. This is this is this is this is this is just sudden's boyfriend. Confirm. Okay, mountain power. Oh my god, it's a butter. Everything is butterfly. Why? Why is there? It's all butterfly. Oh my god, it's a butterfly that. Okay, that smashes. Oh my god, are you sure it's a butterfly? Or is that a moth? Yeah, bro. I'm gonna tell you right now. I ain't seen no butterfly that big before in my life. Yeah, look at look at the size of the butterfly. The size of the butterfly is the size of the damn skeleton warrior. That's a damn moth. Yeah, this is a, this a moth. Yeah, you guys think these are butterflies? These are actually moths. Oh my god, dude. Look at that thing. Yeah, okay, let's see. Wish immortality here. Oh my god, everything is butterfly. Everything is butterfly. 
Everything is butterfly. It looks great though. It looks great. I like it. Yeah, everything is butterfly though. The, the whole theme is butterflies. Oh my gosh. Now we know. Confirm. Fall likes butterflies. It's, it's just confirmed. It's guaranteed, bro. All right. Let's take a look at Chiwoo. These, these, see, the thing about the pioneers is they all have big animations. So I'm expecting something big from these uh, skills, right? These uh, using these transmogs. Okay. And North Star Wisdom. Here we go. Okay, that is nothing special at all. But I guess skill two is not that crazy. Yeah. Okay. It's Yin and Yang into butterflies exploding. Okay. Nice. Not bad. Sleeve attack. This is where it's at. Here it is. Here it is. Okay. It, it's, a, it's a big butterfly. And the animation is just bigger and brighter now. Okay. Fine. I guess I can deal with it. Yeah, I guess they just slap a butterfly and it's, a, it's instantly going to be an okay transmog. Is that is that the thought process behind this? All right. Okay. All right. I kind of like it. Sure. Okay. Pung Beck. Skill 1. Wow. Pung Beck looks very vibrant. Does he not? Skill 1 is so much faster. Oh, yeah. That was one thing, too. People used to complain Skill 1 was so slow. Yeah. Skill 1 is a lot faster now that I've noticed. You're right. That's pretty fast because this is only one times. Not bad. That's interesting to know. All right. Lightning of Cycle. Yin and Yang. Oh, my God. There's a butterfly as well at the top. Everything got a butterfly. Yeah. Yin, Yang, and Butterfly. I kind of like the theme, though. Yeah. But why couldn't it be a pair? I guess it wouldn't be nice as a bird, but... Still, you can butterfly theme, have butterfly aura, and still have a parrot. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm seriously just saying. Yeah, you can butterfly theme, but still have a parrot. Nothing wrong with that, man. Yeah, you seriously, it's no problem. All right, Nigong. Sleep, mountain power, and hev heavenly protection. Wow, that's a big animation. That, that is a lot of butterflies. That is a lot of butterflies, my friend. Yeah, it looks glamorous, but let's be real, man. If, if I, if this, maybe just me. Yeah, but if I was standing there and that many butterflies were flying around, I'd run, bro. Hell no, bro. That's too many bugs in one spot. Look at all the damn butterflies flying out of there. Yeah. People say, oh my god, it's so majestic. Oh my god, butterflies. Yeah, in reality. <laughs> oh, so many bugs. Oh my god, this fucking butterfly is like as big as my damn head. Yeah, let's be real. All right, uh, last last one, Woonsa though. Yeah, let me take a look at Woonsa here. Oh, I didn't even notice their ponytails. Oh my God, that is a nice touch. Okay, I, g I give you a plus right there. Yeah, do you guys see the, the long ponytail that they have in the back? I like that. I like that. That's actually that's actually really dope. I didn't I, I didn't even realize that. Yeah, they all got a ponytail. Is is it a, is it a it's a butterfly clip or something, isn't it? Oh, no, it's just a butterfly thing on their uh, their, their 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 shirt. That's cool. I like that. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. We already did this one. Uh, skill one. Wunsa. If you guys don't know, we've summoned two Wunsas. Yeah, beginning of uh, the year already. It's only been, what, two weeks into the year? Okay. And inhale magic. Yo, that's got to be the worst one. Yo, that's like that. <laughs> is is just me or is that like the most underwhelming one yet? Can you imagine? Yeah, the owners of uh, Woonsas. Oh my god, dude! New transmog. Yes, I'm gonna be one of the few people in the world with the Woonsa transmog. Yeah, I know why I'm going to be one of the few people with Wunsa Transmog. Because ain't nobody going to get the Wunsa Transmog. Because, you know, it, yeah, it, it, it looked like this. Okay. All right. Anyways, um, overall, very solid. Yeah, I think this set of Transmogs is solid. Like, there's nothing I can say that is, like, bad. You know, sometimes there's some Transmogs that are not that good. But this set entirely is not bad. In particular, the Ninjas. All right? The Ninjas... Uh, maybe uh, the Hathor and Bastet third skill. Uh, the look of the pioneer, missing the parrot. Yeah, error 404, no parrot found. Um, missing the parrot, but the look is nice. I just need the damn parrot or bird or hummingbird or something, man. But the look is nice. Yeah, I like the ponytail. I like the animation that's on some of them. It's it's sleek. Yeah, but ninjas win it for me here. 
hands down. Yeah, in particular, let's be real. Orochi wins it here. I'm just saying, yeah. Yo, Lucid, thank you for the five, man. Let's be real, these transmogs are almost all dude. They're actually not bad. Uh, I've, we've, I've seen worse than this. Yeah, we, we always do these uh, these uh, reviews on the uh, transmogs, and there's been way worse ones, dude. They're just, just completely unviable, not even nice, to be honest. Yeah, absolutely trash ones. And these are not bad because of the fact that I do like their 3D models. Yeah, I do rate uh, two things. Their 3D models and their animations. Yeah, and in a whole, not the worst set out there, but definitely not, far from being the best. Yeah, far from being the best. But I, I, out of maybe, maybe I could say out of all of them for the 3D models, this one has some of the best 3D models for the entire pack, right? Hard to beat the dragons and like the archangels, but not bad. Yeah, I, I actually want this Orochi. That's about it, to be honest. <laughs> but all right, boys and girls. Um, yeah, that's gonna be it for it. Oh, actually, wait. Not done yet. Not done yet. Last thing. Yeah, people said that we can take a look at the new. Yeah, the new transmog, right? Yeah, right. That's, that's that's next season RTA available as season. I don't like it, dude. I don't like it, bro. Yeah, I feel like I feel like they're trying to give us a story here. You know what I mean? Like as like the the the, the beast monk's age. Yeah. Hey, in your in your twenties. Yeah, life is good. Yeah. Hey, growing up. You know. In your 30s, your 40s, life is good, yeah? Hey, hella old now, yeah? You become a shaman. You know, what, what? Is it just the life story of the uh, of the beast monks right there? Yeah, yeah, in like the three transmogs. Yeah, what's the next one after this? It's just gonna be like a, a, a stone plate, yeah? R.I.P. What the hell? Bruh. Yeah, it's like his transmogative journey into becoming a shaman. Uh, I don't know. He looks hella old though, true or false? His face looks hella old in, this, in these transmogs. Yeah, he's progressively looked older and older. I don't know. Yo, Splash Boy with a thousand videos. So much butterflies, OMG. Nice, but the ninjas would be the greatest. I do like the ninjas. But like I said, I think some people like uh, that uh, really like, you know, butterflies and stuff will get the Pioneer Transmogs because it does look nice, right? The butterflies are nice. It's just not what I was looking for. Yeah, just, uh, I, I just want the bird from the Pioneer, man. Yeah, the cute-ass bird. But, uh, okay, last but not least here is the Transmogs for next season RTA. And I mean, it, it, I don't like it too much. I don't think it's the most epic transmog ever, but it'll be different, right? The, the the one thing is we are only gauging and judging the looks. Yeah, the aura is nice. Yes, I like the aura. Yeah, but uh, oh yeah, we should look at the new aura, right? You're right. But uh, I like. Uh, see, we're, we're only gauging the looks, but we're not gauging the animations. And as we know, uh, beast monks have big animations. Right? So I'm very curious to see what the animations look like, but we won't know that until they get released later. You won't get to know it until just before the season's done. So look forward to seeing those animations. Uh, some people said, uh, what you call auras? Or oh, auras? Where are the auras? Is that, is that the new one? Yeah, right here. Okay, that's enough. 
Anyways, um, that's exactly what it reminds me of, that Lord of the Rings. So what a flashback. <laughs> uh, what a flashback, yeah. Yeah, they don't think anybody knows. Huh? They're like, oh, you know, Copters is like, oh, what's the new idea for, for Aura? Ah, oh, yeah. I used to like Lord of the Rings. Ain't nobody will expect this. They would never expect us. Yeah, that's too old, bro. Yeah, the kids this generation, they, they forgot about Lord of the Rings. Hey, no. I ain't forget about that, bro. How do you forget about Lord of the Rings? Yeah, what a joke. Yeah, but it does literally look like the eye, bro. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, overall, I think it looks okay. We'll see how it looks on uh, different units. Yeah, once, uh, once it gets released. Oh, can we see the last one yet? Oh, wait, 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 wait. There's one last thing that we can look at. How do I see the chicken? How do I see the chicken? Where can I see the chicken? Where can I see the chicken? Where can I see the chicken? We cannot see the chicken, can we? Oh, no, there should be a place we can see the chicken. Right? There's gotta be a place. Where, where's Elia's house? Where's the one that we put Elia in? We can't? Where's the chicken? Where's the chicken? Where's Elia's house? Which one is Elia's house? Where, which one is Elia's house? Elia's outfits? Where the hell is Elia? Elia, say something. You mother ding dong, where the hell are you? Are you on this island? Yo, how do I get to Elia? Notice? What do you mean notice? It's in the main tower with storage? Storage. Ah, uh, ah, uh, no, you a liar. Oh, profile? Ah, change costume. Oh, I clicked this earlier. Rides, rides. Here we go. Oh! Ho, ho! <laughs> yes! Yes, bro! Yes! Yes! This is what I want, dude! Yes! This is the highlight, bro! Yeah, I know it looks like a chocobo, but I, this is the highlight, bro. Yeah? This, this, this is the exact highlight of next season RTA. Okay? If you're gonna do next season RTA, no matter what rank you are, you gotta do enough till you get this. Okay? You gotta get this. This is the most exciting thing that you got to us. Yeah. Look at this guy, man. So cute, bro. Actually cute AF. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh, I want this. I want that. Damn, dude. Best thing is Sona's Oh my god. Uh, you can get that for just being fighter. Oh, okay. So if you be fighter, you can get it then. Interesting. All right. <clears throat> All right. Congratulations. Yeah. I mean, well, I mean, that's awesome. I mean, I'm very excited. I'm very excited. Yeah. So congratulations to people that uh, get fighter next season and uh, get that uh, that new you, that new uh, what you call mount. How do you go there again? Oh, now now I know. Here, profile, and then it can go to change costume really easily. There we go. All right, boys and girls. If you are watching from the YouTube channel. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, going over some of the transmogs, the fun shenanigans that took place, the auras, the new RTA skins, the amazing mount coming up next season. We can get fighter, push for it. I wish you the best of luck. And uh, yeah, that's going to be it. So definitely leave a comment below. Let me know uh, your thoughts on what your favorite thing coming up is, whether it's the transmog or the RTA skin or um, this chicken. Yeah, let me know. But uh, that's going to be it for YouTube here. So until the next uh, live stream or video, I'll see you guys later. Hello, YouTube. Bye-bye.